All right, we've been waiting with bated breath, Ray, <laughs> to hear what you have to say at this very moment with the forecast. Go ahead. Uh, I have some good news. Yeah. I have some good news. If you like lower humidity, mm -hmm. I have some good news for you. If you All like right. sunshine, I have some good news for you. There. <laughs> If you like temperatures to warm back up to those low to mid 80s, I have some news for you as well because all these things are going to be happening. We already have the skies trying to clear out. Now we still have some clouds in places. In addition to that, we're going to see some pockets of fog trying to develop, but you can see uh, Armstrong County is sort of plagued with some of those showers. But as the day was ending and those showers were still falling in spots, we had some rainbows reported. This one from Paul and Kelly Bell out in Allegheny Township. Beautiful rainbow there, actually a double uh, rainbow. The second one was was uh, sort of faded there. But uh, overall, we have a, a decent looking night here in Pittsburgh. We still have some clouds that we're dealing with trying to break up here in town. And you can see 67 degrees comes with that wind still just over 10 miles per hour out of the north. And those will calm down tonight. And as that happens and as our temperatures and dew points get closer and closer together, we're going to see these pockets of fog trying to settle out. But that'll happen more where we have some clearer skies showing up. But overall, temperatures in most locations are hanging out in these uh, mid to upper 60s at this point and we're going down to the upper 50s and low 60s for lows tonight. So 60 Pittsburgh, 60 Butler, 60 in Washington, uh, 62 Latrobe and Connellsville, Morgantown as well, 61 in uh, Indiana with 60 for Clarion. Mid to upper 70s for high temperatures tomorrow, right where these numbers should be. 78 is average, so not too far off the mark. The difference between tomorrow and what we had today was our temperatures are going to be similar, but we're going to have less humidity and we're going to get more sunshine out of the deal. Warmer temperatures for Friday, Saturday, but you'll notice the, the drop in temperatures here between Saturday and Sunday. That's an indication that a cold front's coming in. A lot of times that means some rain, and that's what we're going to be dealing with. So tonight, 60 degrees, partly cloudy skies, pockets of fog developing by morning. And then tomorrow, we're going to get those temperatures back to the mid to upper 70s, warmer for Friday and Saturday. Late Saturday, we have that rain or thunderstorm chance to pop up here. But I think the better shots for rain are Sunday, Monday. Temperatures fall off to the mid 70s there, and we keep it in the low to mid 70s for Tuesday and Wednesday of next week.